And welcome back, this is Butler Scooby with an episode of Let's Play Xenogears. I am joined as always by Fei Fong Wong, Bot Ball, I thought of you, Fatima, Maji, Nissan, and a pink ball of fluff that won't leave me alone. We are in the Nissan something mausoleum. I don't know what the proper name is, I just know it is the mausoleum. And we need to head up this floor here, just on the other side of where we entered. I remember this place being quite confusing, so you'll have to excuse me if there are kind of a lot of pause breaks as I double check that I know what I'm doing, because chances are I do not. So let's go through here. We need to save the people of Nissan. It's awful dark in here. Yes, yes it is. They probably have the power shut down because no one's here. Yes, the lower level is mausoleum, so it always has minimal power available for use, but not even the sisters are allowed in there. Okay, there's mold. No one's been in there. Let's move on. We gotta get to the treasure before Shikan gets here. We need that treasure! Well, okay, the place isn't confusing so far, but I remember it being just like a freaking maze. <sighs> Not looking forward to it. Hey, it's the uh, the one winged angels. <laughs> ah, every time I say that, I think it's off. The same angel statue at the cathedral. So this is the door that connects to the great royal treasure. Is that a retinal scanner or a gun? I'm gonna assume retinal scanner. It's time for the Fatima Jasper to do its thing. Oh yeah, one of mine's closed. I'm here. Y you would think Bart would keep that in mind. Why, why not just Margie? She could do it. All by herself. Why does Bart even need to be here? Wait, it's his left eye that's got the blindfold on it? Or the, the eye patch? But maybe it requires two different people. So it just responds to blue eyes, I assume? Whatever. The Fatima Jasper. Yeah, that punk Shikan mistook that for a royal pendant. But that made it easier for us, so I kept my mouth shut. What's up ahead? Up ahead will be the central core of the fortress. It's been said that if we shine that mysterious light across our eyes, the fortress will rise to the surface. They say this was built before the country of Ave was founded, so you ready to go? Uh, apparently I don't have a choice. I don't think there's anything else in this room here, so let's just go right through. Now I think there's actually two ways to go in here. Let's take the left route first. Yeah. What have we got in here? There sure are a lot of gauges and meters in here. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Anything else you want to point out? You want to say that it's red in here, too? That'd be great if you could point that out to me. I wonder which is more impressive, the pilot room on your ship or the one in here? My ship, of course. Nothing is better than my ship and the missiles, the BART missiles. Since they are our ancestors, I guess this one's better. Everything was better before. And you quit asking mean questions like that. Anyway, it's not called a pilot room. It's the bridge. Got it? Does it really matter? Not really. No. You're just going to stand over there, Margie? Fine, I'll just leave. Oh, she caught up. Over here, we get a desert worm. Which I don't remember what that is. That honestly sounds like a weapon for Bart. It is. Yeah, why not put that on there? It doesn't... Yeah, just two extra damage, because why not? I don't think I actually need to use the safe one right here. So let's go ahead and go through the door. You know, we haven't really fought anything yet, so it's the safe one for the entrance of the, the dungeon. Number two elevator block. Up directional energy. So apparently this one goes up. So let's, let's do that. Go up, since it's my only option. So I'm doing too. Uh, I'm doing alright so far. I haven't gotten lost, but I'm sure that'll change. 
It always changes. Let's go. Oh, now it's kind of teal-ish. Uh, okay, so yes, here we go. I believe I want to go kind of north is first. first. Mm. There we go. This is where I want to go. Energy block. Uh, okay. So we're going through the energy block. I don't think there's anything in that first one here. So let's go ahead and go to the second one. Here we go. Second door. And in here, we have a f long, narrow hallway with a door. Yes, sweet. I love doors. Um, it's another Jasper lock. You guys need to stand there. There's another Jasper lock. That's what, that's what I just said. Let's try it out. That completely missed Margie's eye. I'm not even going to lie. That wasn't even close. I'm not reminded of, of uh, 56k modem right now. Uh, I have no idea what that did, so I'm just going to go ahead and drop a save real fast. Be right back. Alright, I think I know what that did now. When checked it. Uh, so I actually need to leave here right now. Let's... Wait, Margie walks as fast as we run? That's insane. Yeah, we need to go back here because there's a... It's actually a treasure chest I missed. So let's go ahead and go here. This is the one I'm looking for. And through here, we find an. Uh, why is everything need to be so long? There's no battles here. We find a Death Blower 1, which, if you remember right, we already had equipped on the Brigandier, but that's another one. What the hell is this? This thing is huge. Doesn't seem like I can do anything here. Ah, oh, I can't even... Oh. Okay, apparently it's a lower platform. And I'm suddenly reminded of one of the opening things of Half-Life. Like the original Half-Life. You remember when uh, when he first like introduces the aliens and the head crabs and all that crap? Uh, that room reminds me of that. Okay, so that's all the treasure. Really, I mean, this place is huge, and there's a lot of rooms, but very, very little in the way of treasure. So let's go back to where the, the Jasper was, which is right there. And then uh, we'll, we'll continue on to the end of uh, this hallway. And, yeah, you see that kind of little light over here? Yeah. I think this is the way I want to go. Just randomly. Just walk through here. Why not? Why not walk through here? Oh. Oh, that must be the Omni Gear. This is very impressive. I refuse to say that word. It kind of looks like a. Kind of looks a lot like Bot's Gear. Huh? Oh, yeah. Now that you mention it. Well. Trace my brigadier's history. It was a gear that originally made Nave that I customized. It wouldn't surprise me if there was some connection. Yeah, well. Looks like there's no power drawn here except for the emergency lights. Is that what those are? It's gear 2. No power in the lights. The drive unit's been sealed. Hmm. There might be something around here. Okay. Hold on for one second. Okay, now that that's done, I think we just go right up to it, and yeah. Something's written here. Does anyone have a light? Choo-choo, if you, like, freaking snap your fingers, I'm gonna be pissed. This. There's an inscription. It's an old Fatima. It's my ancestors. What does it say? Peace to all those who come here. Fearing great calamity, we sealed this legacy, entrusting its fate to you. The freaking is the brigandier. Area one. Now the lights turn on. Oh, that's where the control room was. Remember the first save point out there.
Okay, this should work. Now, how do I get it out? You. Y you said it would appear above if it read the eyes. Either you can move this building? No. That last room looked like a bridge. Let's check it out. Father, looks like we're gonna have to move this. Sorry, but I'll have to borrow it. I want it. It looks awesome. I know it's supposed to be like an emotional scene, but it's freaking equipment. Oh! Nice. We get the... I still think it's Midgar music. Yeah, that's what it sounds like to me. Alright, so as you can see, the, the, the power's on. You notice that this thing doesn't have a generator here. So, yeah, we, they don't really tell you where to go. This is why I remember having such a hard time with this. Well, this isn't the Midgar music. What am I talking about? This... Well, it still sounds like it's from Final Fantasy VII. It sounds like the Junon music a bit. Like a... Whatever, I'm overthinking it. It's nice music, either way. So what we need to do is go back to that control room, so... Let's head that way. Number two, elevator block. I know this is the way we need to go. Yeah, that's right, because there's the energy block, and then this must be the elevator block. Choo-choo, why do you bounce? Why do you freaking bounce, choo-choo? Energy... Wait, energy block? Ah, I'm going around in a circle. That is not what I wanted to do at all. Okay. So, hopefully I can remember how to friggin' do this. I think this is the way I wanted to go. There we go. Was that really so hard? No. No, it was not. Go down. I mean, there's really no... Well, there's not no landmarks, but there's very few landmarks in this place, and that's why it always gets so confusing, especially when they make you run through it like two or three times. Alright, so let's go back to the control room. Choo-choo keeps bouncing. <laughs> 